my channel. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Welcome back to my channel again. So in this video, we're gonna kick off this year with a Dyson haul. This is gonna be part two that we're gonna be doing. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I'm laughing because my husband is watching me while I'm doing this and I don't like filming um, when he's around. It's just, it's, I'm shy, you know, I'm shy. But, <clears throat> so, Vegas open up a Daiso. If you haven't seen my um, first Daiso haul, I will link it up here so you guys can see that one. And that's what we're going to be doing today. So let's go see what I got from Daiso. Okay guys, so first I actually want to clean this area up. I got some organization for the inside of this. Um, if you can, <clears throat> if you've seen my previous clean with me, I organized this and now it's a mess again. And I don't have, everything is pretty much in this Ziploc um, bags. So I got um, a little bit of organization stuff for this um, section right here so that's what we're gonna be doing first and I will show you guys the things that I got for this area Finally, you guys, um, Las Vegas opened up a, a Daiso here. And on my other Daiso haul, um, when I went shopping in California, that was a couple months ago, I was telling you guys that we don't have Daiso here and I wish that there was a Daiso here. And I don't know, they finally opened one and it's literally <clears throat> 13 minutes from my house. And I just wanna say that the Daiso here is not the same thing as the California, I guess, because there's not much of an option. It wasn't as big as what they have in california and that is why i didn't really get a lot from this second dicer haul um, but i got um, a good amount actually but that i don't know i feel like um they're either out of stock because there's always a long line outside um this the first and the second time i went um there's always like a long line but I just want to say that we have to be grateful for what we have and we have to be thankful and just appreciate that we do have the things that we have around us. So I am still very, very grateful and thankful that they open up one here close to our house. Um, it doesn't matter if it's big or not. I am still very grateful for it. So yeah, we thank you God. Feel this way, don't know what you do. 
so I'm going to be using this folder for the things that I keep from Zane's school, like some paperwork that he takes home sometimes. So instead of putting it in this Ziploc bag, I'm going to be transferring it on this um, folder. When we have the spirit of gratitude in all the things that we do and say, we will experience the greater happiness and joy and peace and satisfaction in our lives. And we will also recognize the influence and the blessings of our Lord. And this is why we have to be grateful for every little thing that God has given us and blessed us with. And this is why my husband and I, we always give all the glory to God. I promise I won't leave your side. And the other thing that we got are these cute eraser. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. My son really wanted to get these but they're so cute they're just like a mini eraser so here's the after shot Everything is nice and organized. And here's the other side. It's pretty full, but it fits. It's still closed. And I put the folder that we got from Daiso under there. So that's how it's looking on this side. And the other thing that I got from Daiso are these brushes. Our sink um, brushes are due for a change. And so that's why I got all of these as well. the brush that I just showed you guys I will be using it to hand wash my daughter's clothes as you can see in here um, my daughter's clothes are very dirty um, it doesn't matter if we wash it in our washer with Clorox or anything like that it's it won't take out the stain I don't know why and I've been meaning to actually hand wash and brush all of her clothes um, because every time they go out and play outside it gets um, dirty like um, from the dust or like on the floor when they sit and stuff like that so it won't take out the block the black stains <laughs> and so I've been meaning to really hand wash them and I'm using a cutting board for this because I don't have the wood thing where you can brush it and stuff like that so I'm just improvising here and I just want to say that when I was doing this I was telling my husband that 
it reminds me of like how i used to live back in the philippines we don't have a yeah we do have a, a washing machine but we do have to hand wash it and we have to hang it it's like an old-fashioned way to wash your clothes and i am just like very very grateful for everything that god um, has given me because of the things that I experienced back when I was in the Philippines and to what I have now it's it's such a big big change in my life and so that I am very very grateful and very happy that um, I have all the things that I have now it's a lot easier um, to wash my clothes and stuff like that but this just kind of like humbled me when I was doing this and it just reminds me of where I came from you know and we gotta be um, grateful for where we came from because it makes us who we are now And here's how it looks like the water is very very dirty <laughs> and all of these I hand washed and brush it by hand and the ones that I'm gonna be sharing sh showing you guys which is the one on the floor they're all dry and I didn't have to hand wash or brush them because they don't have that stain or the black stuff on them so yeah it's ready to go in the washer and i just had to pretty much clean this up and next thing that we got we already used it but it's this little popsicle holder thing or is that what you call it but we made some chocolate for them and the kids love it and also guys i've been meaning to get this um strainer like with a bowl on it and so that it's easier for me to wash um, fruits and vegetables and I finally got one from Daiso and it's affordable it's like I think two dollars or four dollars or something like that so I'm very happy with this purchase In Psalms 104 to 5, it says, Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good and his love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations. Take me back all the way back. And in Colossians 2, 6-7, it says, So then, just as you received Christ Jesus as Lord, continue to live your lives in Him, and rooted and built up in Him, strengthened and in faith as you were thought, and overflowing with thankfulness.
Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down and I hope that you guys enjoyed this Daiso haul. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have been to a Daiso before. If you live in Las Vegas area, um, there is a new Daiso um, in Arroyo Crossing Parkway. I believe that's where it's at. <laughs> I'm very bad with direction, but we have one now in here in Vegas. So um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what's your favorite one that I got so far in this um, video. And yeah, let's just uh, finish making this dinner and let's take a break and eat. And I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please don't forget to give it a like, subscribe, and join the family. You know, I would love for you to be part of our family. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. You can say I lost my mind. I will keep on holding my head high. Even if the sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down